<coughs> yeah, we're back. <sighs> All right. You had to get out of his system. Yep. Yeah, sorry. Sorry. I uh, um, uh, had some really powerful lemonade before we uh, started this. So he uh, did. Yeah. I really, really chucked me up. Had some strong stuff they have. They're making these days. Uh, let me just. Oh, and I screwed up the song. Sorry. Remix. <laughs> There it is. There we go. All right. We killed it. We killed it. All right. So let's continue our conversation about um, terrible or non-terrible Disney Channel shows. Oh, yeah. We were talking and, about that. And uh, rating them. Um, so I'm going to pull up a list okay. of all the live-action Disney shows. Okay. And we're going to try and... You know what? You, you you tell me the show. I'll tell you if it's good or bad. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> all right. Uh, let's try to keep it to t early 2000s, late 90s. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. 90s, 2000s shows. All right, all right. Let's let, get this guy waddled in here real quick. <laughs> all right, well, it's pulling me. Okay, I'm going to go through the list. It pulled up some cartoon ones, too, but they're good ones. I mean, that's fine. I'm, I'm not... We can we can do we can do uh, all the Disney Channel shows. That's yeah, fine. Why way. not? Why not? Kim Possible, fantastic, real banger of a show. That uh, that live action one looks terrible. Uh, yeah, that came out last year. Did it? Yeah. Okay. Um, or beginning of this year. I don't know. Twenty twenty is like five years rolled into one. Yeah. Come back here, you bastard. Um, I forgot Animal Crossing came out this year because of that. <laughs> yeah. Right. Um, was a lifetime ago. Honestly, though. Um, Let's see. That's so Raven. Uh, great show. Great show. Great show. I don't remember much from it, but it's a great show. How do you not remember that much from it? She gazes into the future. I know Raven. all that she can. All that she can see. That's right. It, I know she's on the View. Oh, that's right. She, oh my God, I Raven's forgot she was view. on the View. Yeah. Some, like <laughs> somehow she snuck in there. It's a random poll. Although I mean, I guess the View is kind of a random cast because they had a uh, uh, Sharon Osbourne. Oh, that's right. She was on there too with Whoopi. With Whoopi. With Whoopi. Yo, just a weird, like, random... Don't, don't be talking about my Whoopi. I'm not going to talk shit about Whoopi. Whoopi's yeah. great. Whoopi, Whoopi is a national treasure. Just, it's just, you know, four people from, like, completely different sides of, like, the celebrity spectrum might never oh, have thought Whoopi together. But I think that's why The View works, is because they're all from different... Because it wouldn't work if it was just five Bar Barbara Walters just there, yeah. you know? <laughs> Taking over the conversation. Yeah, just, you know... Five white women from Texas, you know that that's not nobody wants that. So yeah, I don't know where Barbara Walters is from, but <laughs> she looks like she was born in Texas, to be honest with you. So uh, anyway, next show, Lizzie McGuire. Uh great show, great, absolutely, absolute banger of a show, and they're bringing it back. They're bringing it back on Disney Plus. Are they getting Hillary Duff for that? Uh she's playing the mom. Oh, okay. She's playing the freaking mom. Hey, that works. It's so, all like. Okay, so she's not, it's not like Lizzie McGuire in the future, like she's just playing the mom of Lizzie McGuire. No, she's playing, no, she's she is Lizzie McGuire, but she's the mom. Oh. She's a mom now. Yeah. Huh. Wow. Yeah. All right. Pretty dope. Pretty yeah. freaking dope. I'm I'm curious to see what comes of that. I, yeah, I have no idea. I, apparently they still got like Gordo and all them, like the same people. Wow, they managed to get the cast back. Yeah, it, that's what I that's what I heard. Yeah, so Gordo's still gonna be in there. I don't know if the one chick, her best friend's gonna be in there. Okay. I don't remember. Uh, maybe. Uh, maybe. But I'm pretty sure she was like, it Miranda. Yes, yeah, Miranda. Uh, let's see. It doesn't say anything in our IMDb about her coming back. Okay. Maybe. Who? Maybe they just haven't like announced anything about. Maybe it. you never know. So who knows. Uh, we kind of already brushed past this one. Sweet Life is Zack and Cody. Oh, terrible show. Horrible me? show. Are you kidding me? Fucking who? The, the yeah. Sprouse twins are like two of the worst human beings I've yeah, ever met. They're just like ripoffs of the Olsen twins. Like honestly, they're not. They're not. They're just terrible people. Get it out of there. Throw, <laughs> throw it in the bad bin. <laughs> for all, for all honesty, that was a great show too. It was a fantastic show. Oh, fantastic. Did a lot of spinoffs of that show. Actually, no, they did. Uh, they did one where they were on a cruise. They did. Uh, technically, there's two spinoffs of that. No, no, actually, there's technically only one spinoff of that show, and then be, um, there's a spinoff of the spinoff. <laughs> so follow that logic. That's right, man. They were really milking that IP. Yeah, yeah, because they did Sweet Life of Zach and Cody. Then 
they were like, oh, you know what we need? Oh, we, we need them to be on a boat. So yeah. they lived on a cruise ship for three seasons. It's like Sweet Life on deck. Yeah, Sweet Life on deck. And then um, they were like, you know what? Uh, the girl that we got to play um, uh, the smart kid's girlfriend or whatever, um, she was really good. So we let, you know what? We're going to turn just her into a show. Yeah. And like, yeah, so. Weird. Crap. I didn't get the freaking leaf out. My bad. <laughs> <laughs> busy right. thinking about Zach and Cody. Yeah, too too busy thinking about Zach and Cody. That's what's really important. Yeah. Um. Anyway, uh, next. even Steven. Even Stevens. I wasn't a big even Steve. It, it is a classic. Don't get me wrong. Yeah. Don't get me wrong. I was not a big fan of even Stevens. To be honest with you. It's another like family show. There's, yeah. There's a lot of them. You kind of have to pick and choose. Yep. Absolutely. Uh, that one. What was the gimmick of that one? It, I don't remember. You know what? I I really don't. Was what am I supposed to do here? I thought I already had it, but we. Uh... Oh, it's just uh, it's kind of Shia LaBeouf, wasn't it? That's right. Oh yeah, no, I knew that. I knew Shia. That was the the big Shia LaBeouf show. Um, yes. That's where he started, and that's how he got holes, and then then he became insane. So it's great. <laughs> uh, he's um, coming back though. He's no, he is. He's absolutely coming back. I remember. Yeah, he's made a good recovery. Yeah, I've seen a couple of his interviews, and he's actually a pretty, pretty sane dude. Yeah, so. yeah. happy to see it. Mm -hmm. Um, proud family. Proud family is actually a pretty, pretty dope show. That show's I feel, a banger. I feel like that show is a bit underrated. To be yeah. honest with you, they um, just recently put it back on uh, on uh, Disney Plus. Are they? I guess they're putting it on their first time. Yes. Yeah. If I remember correctly. Yep. Um. Yeah, that show was pretty good. Yeah, that show was that show was a banger. Um, that, that it definitely did not get the screen time that it deserved. So. No, yeah, not at all. It, it lasted four years. It looks like it looks like most of these shows have only lasted like two, three years at most. Yeah, they usually don't last more than that on Disney Channel. So yeah, you think that they would make them last longer? Yeah. Although Phineas and Ferb is holding strong from 2007 to 2015. Oh yeah, yeah. Phineas and Ferb? You kidding me? Yeah. How do you? How else? Do I, how else would you know? what the plastic piece on the end of the shoelace is. Like, come on. They did a whole episode on that. This is true. The right. aglet, dude. The, the infamous aglet. 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 Yeah, thank you. Um, yeah. Phil of the future. I don't remember what this one is. Phil, Phil, Phil of the future. Yeah, the 20th century, man. A family from 2021 is stuck in 2004 trying to desperately fit in. So, you remember the show Third Rock from the Sun? Yes. So, imagine show. Disney Channel version of that. So, it's like watered down? Yes. That, that's exactly what Phil of the Future is. It's just Third Rock from the Sun, Disney Channel. Like, that's, that's what it is. And now, we're going to use Disney Channel as a verb. So. What channel was Third Rock on? That was NBC, I think it was? I was thinking, yeah, it was either NBC or ABC. They're both yeah. kind of the same. Yeah. That's just all. It's basic cable. Yeah. <laughs> just put some like three random letters together and you're yeah. good. Like USA. Yep. TBS. TBS. CNN. Uh, uh, CUM. Anyway. HBO. <laughs> it really is always just like three letters. <laughs> God damn. Um, there we go. Um, no, don't freaking fly, you idiot. Yeah. There we go. This is the good stuff. There we go. Oh, that's right. He plants things. Oh, yeah. Oh, and you can grapple them, right? And you get the hook? Yep. That's right. Dude, you freaking spoiled it for me. I didn't know we were going to get the hook in this one. <laughs> I'm sorry. <clears throat> can uh, uh, go back and uh, I'm going to censor that one. You know what? Uh, what's the next show? Keep reading me shows here. Oh, uh, oh, well, here's a banger. What? Wizards of a Waverly Place. That show is terrible. The, the actual show is not great. If, if, if I'm being truthfully honest... The show itself is not, it's not the best. That was but, uh, Selena Gomez's first yeah. show, right? Yep. Yeah. That's that's what put her on the map. I thought it was fine. It's I'd... it's a fine show. I'm not. I don't want. But the only reason, like the only reason I personally watched it for four seasons, is because of Selena Gomez. Yeah. I'm just being perfectly honest here. Yeah. Um. So. There's a. I was gonna say there's a reason why she. She moved on and everybody else didn't. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Um, weirdly enough, I think the younger brother is still doing stuff for Disney. I think he's doing like ABC Family shows or something like that. Oh, of course. So, is that... Or it's not ABC. Wow. 
There's a guy kind of dating me right there. It's freeform <laughs> now. That's Jeez. Right. David Henry is his name. Yeah. Yep. He was in Paul Blart Mall Cop, and that was the last movie he was in. Nice. No! Nope, never mind. That's not true. He stole my dude. <laughs> he's in a movie. He's in a Reagan movie. Ooh. Uh, he's a young Reagan. Oh, they stole my dude. That sucks. Not your man's. Not your my, little boy. My man's fell down. Ooh, my man's fell down. Yeah. All right. All right, here we go. Weird. Um, well, we've already covered Phineas and Ferb, but yeah. that show's great. That, that show is actually great. Here's another good one. American Dragon. American Dragon was solid. Not a fan of it? I So, I mean, I, I watched it a lot. Um, um, I wasn't... I mean, it's not... It, it, it could have been better. That's what I like. Oh, sure. Um, I think... Also, like, the way... They only really gave it... They didn't really give it very much, if we're being honest. Yeah, no. Like, they, they... It didn't last long. No. Plus, I think it was... I don't even think that was technically on J Disney Channel. I think it was on Toon Disney at the time. So... Yeah, I, it might have been Toon Disney. Yeah. I was, so, was going to say, because that, that would have been... When did Disney XD become a thing? I don't even remember, dude. That was... That was, that was probably a decade late. ago, at least. Yeah. Yeah. Say so this came out in 2005, so okay. that's right. The American Dragon soundtrack was done by Jonas Brothers. Was it? Or at least like the the um, the main theme, American Dragon, was performed by Jonas Brothers. Huh. Wow. Keeping it within the family. I don't think I ever watched that one actually. Huh. Uh, it looks like it says season two, so maybe they only did the one for season two. I think that show only got two seasons. Yeah, it only got. Oh, yeah. Huh. Man, I cannot believe I didn't realize that that was done by the Trucking Jones Brothers. Weird. Here's your favorite show. Brandy and Mr. Whiskers. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> Brandy and Mr. Whiskers. Whiskers. <laughs> it's so good. It's so good. It's stu- It's like, you know, it's the Disney Channel version of those, like, classic cartoon kind oh, of things. Sure. So, like, that's the- uh, It's- It really- really puts me in a good spot when I watch that show. So it's it's stupid, you know. It's one of those really st it's a stupid it's show. It's just but, dumb. But but it's fun. It's like, you know, it's like cow and chicken. You oh know? yeah. Like yeah. It's, it's just nonsense. Like there's no plot to it. No. It's just nonsense. It's just nonsense. You're just on this like weird trip. Yeah. Absolutely. Uh we're getting some kind of rant. Oh no, we're getting to some older stuff. Uh Emperor's New uh, School. Oh yeah, that was a good show. That, that was... came around later than I thought. 2006 mm -hmm. to 2008. Yep. Sure that did. was a lot longer ago. No, it's uh that was a uh... um that show came out a little later, but that was a solid ass show. Yeah. That was a good damn show. Uh I can't remember. I feel like I feel like Kronk was still voiced by Patrick Warburton in that show, if I remember correctly. I think so. Obviously, you weren't going to get David Spade to do a Disney Channel show. No, but... not at all. They got, uh, what's his name? J JP, I'm going to butcher this last name. Um, Hell yeah. Manu? Manu? I don't know. Manyo? Something like that? Ma... Some, somebody. I... My nipples? Like, I don't know. <laughs> this guy who voiced uh, Cusco is also in Phil of the Future. Hmm. And in a okay. lot of episodes of yeah. Oh, well. Well. Moving on. Moving on. <laughs> um. Oh, of course, it's Jonas Brothers. Oh. Or Jonas is what it's called, I guess. Yeah, yeah. The the show that was just about them. Yeah. Um. Yeah, it was that wasn't a good show. I'm just being honest, I love my Jonas Brothers, but that wasn't a good show. It was not their best work. Here's a banger, Buzz Lightyear of Star Command. Oh hell yeah, hell yeah! That's you a show. Me? That was a good damn show, and that it didn't last very long, unfortunately. No, it, it lasted a criminally short one season. Oh my god, that deserved more. It did have a movie. Yeah, it had a movie voiced by Tim Allen, and it had a video game too. Oh yeah, it did. Although like, the show was not voiced by Tim Allen. No, it wasn't. He's you, uh, you, Patrick Warburton. Really? Yeah. Patrick Warburton. He voiced Buzz Lightyear in the show? For the whole 62 episodes, he did. Man. Huh. Now, I'm right. I'm going to have to go back and watch that now. Yeah. Is it, I don't, is it on Disney Plus? I don't think it is. Oh, if it's not, I'm calling Disney right now. Yeah. <laughs> Cowards, give it to us. Give it to us. Huh. All right. All right. I'm down. Totally Circus. I don't... I don't know that one. I don't know what that is either. Total, there's another Totally Hoops. 
Nope. The rest of these are just kind of like just regular stuff. Like uh, there's things like Aaron Stone, I guess. Aaron Stone. Yeah. I don't. Nope. Don't know that one. Totally in tune. What? Yeah. It just sounds like you're just saying random stuff now. Like, it le came out in 2002. It was a reality TV talk show um, set in uh, Los Angeles, California in a uh, high school. Okay. I th think it... Well, it's only got one person in the cast listed at IMDb, so it must not have... Uh, yeah, it must have sucked, so... Maybe it's... Yeah, it says it's a TV series. Oops. Must not have lasted long. It must not have. It definitely must not yeah, have. But the rest of these are just kind of like random. Like Hannah Montana's on here. We've already... Like, well, yeah, we already know that Hannah Montana is, is absolutely the best show that was ever on Disney Channel. Are you kidding me? The Buzz on Maggie. What? I don't know what the... 2005... That doesn't sound appropriate for Disney. No. Yeah, sounds, with you. Yeah. I don't want to know any Buzz on... on, on what was her name? Uh, Maggie. Ooh, Maggie. No. Ooh, oh. Yeah, no, I'm... I'm good. I don't need to know any buzz you got going on. Yeah, that's kind of... That's all IMDb has listed in their top 34. I, there's more shows than 34 that... Yeah, they didn't even list a freaking um, Sunny with a Chance. Sunny the, with a Chance. On, actually, uh, where is Sunny with a Chance? I feel like I did see that. You better be on there. That uh, was, number 12 was Sunny with a Chance. Okay, because that, that was the Demi Lovato show. Yep, that's right. So, they, they better be on there. But, like, there's a lot of shows that are... That are missing. Oh, okay, so it says 2000s. Okay. Okay, so yeah, I was gonna say there's some definitely some shows that are are missing from that list. Oh, I guess I don't have any uh, <laughs> juice. That's why I can't you do anything. Get some juice. I gotta get some juice. Apparently, the skull had some juice. It did. He did not finish his juice. I, li I like the uh, skull juice. I like drinking skull juice. A little skull juice. Yeah. Uh, that's what you get out of the the skull tellas. You get uh, or skull chillas, if some people like to call them. Skull tellas. Get out of here. Um. Skulltulas? Get out of here. They're Skulltulas, dude. Sk yeah, they're Skulltulas. They're sk I, I call them Skulltulas for the, the better part of my life. Yeah, because you're freaking... Mm, it's, um... Skulltula. It's Skulltula. Um, um, actually... Um, actually... <laughs> I'm issue 35. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, uh... Simpsons comic character. <laughs> <laughs> comic book man. I get a lot of those people in at work. I'm sure you do, too. Oh, absolutely. Uh, of course. Boy. Guy, uh, guy came in work and wanted to argue just for the sake of arguing about what the next Smash character was gonna be. Uh huh. And uh, I, I was just told him like, I mean, at this point right now, I could care less because they put Steven from Minecraft, Here we and go. I, I hate Minecraft so much. Um, we should do one small, tiny playthrough of Minecraft. No, we're not playing Minecraft. Just you and I, just on. We're gonna start up a new world, fresh seed, and we're gonna. We're, we're not, just gonna craft. We're not playing Minecraft, dude. One thing of Minecraft. We're not playing Minecraft. We're gonna get one thing of Minecraft, dude. Out of you. We're not playing Minecraft. <laughs> we're gonna. We're absolutely gonna play Minecraft. You can play Minecraft by yourself. That's that's about as far as you're gonna get me. To play if Minecraft. you sat down and played Minecraft and you really gave it like a good shot, you would like it. No, I wouldn't. You wanna know why? Why? Because. Guess what? I haven't been to a McDonald's in four years for the same reason. Well, McDonald's is terrible. Minecraft is great. Nah, I don't know about that, dude. I don't know about that. Uh, we're, you're gonna have to. You're, you're just gonna have to lose this battle, bud. We're not playing Minecraft, so we will get Minecraft. You know what? Go make some you other friends. <laughs> <laughs> you want to play Minecraft that bad? <laughs> we'll leave it to the viewers then. Oh God. In the comments down below, uh -huh. do you want to see Joe play Minecraft? If, you know what? And also, if you leave a comment that says, yes, you guys should play Minecraft, be prepared that I will come to your house, <laughs> and I will steal your refrigerator. I will. Then I will leave a steamy shit on your porch. <laughs> yes. On your No, it's going to be on your kitchen table. Exactly. Exactly. I will leave a shit where... You haven't shit before. Let's put it that way. There so. we go. I will go where no man has shit before. Man, I must have fed the cat something. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. God. <sighs> Minecraft my ass. Oh, it's so relaxing. Yeah, well, I don't find it. I can tell you one thing we're never going to play, though. What? We're not going to play Fortnite. Yeah, we're not going to play Fortnite. Yeah, that's not going to happen. We're on a consensus on that one. Yeah. Why would I... I'm not playing Fortnite. Nope. Sorry guys, sorry if you're really looking for Seismic Heroes, uh, does Fortnite, that's not going to happen in this, uh, um, in this lifetime at least, so, maybe in a different lifetime. 
we do like a, a I don't know if we, maybe we don't hear it this part, but we do like a, a April Fools thing where it's it's one playthrough, but it turns out to just be Fortnite. No, what if it's just Fortnite? It's the thumbnail, and it turns out to be something else. Yeah, we we play, should, we, yeah. that's our Gubble playthrough. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Gubble. <laughs> Gubble. We'll play Gubble. Oh, and yeah, I want to touch Gubble with a, a five foot pole right now. No, that's Ugh. a really bad game. Oh my god. Yeah, one of one of many games that were just just dumped All into right. the PlayStation One library. And I do just want to reiterate this: anybody that thinks that having Steve and Minecraft from Minecraft in fucking Smash is a good idea, you're out of your freaking mind. <laughs> you're out of your absolute freaking mind. I'm just gonna tell you this right now, because this is. All of a sudden, now Smash Bros. isn't Smash Bros. anymore. I don't care what anybody else says. Putting Mine Steve from Minecraft in Smash now no longer makes it Smash Bros. in my opinion. Absolutely. He's a part of gaming history. He's a very important character. Yeah. Well, you know what? Who else is a very important character Who's in that? gaming history? Who's that? Bubsy. And he's not in there, so... Bubsy is not an important character. Yes, he is. Because he, he is ate, a fucking he told, shit stain. He told you how, how to not make a game how to not make a 3D game. That's true. That is true. He did do that. So you cannot tell me he's, he's not, not important. getting in Smash, though. No, he's not getting in Smash. But why wouldn't he be able to be in Smash? At this point, why not just put a freaking oak tree in Smash? Because that would be a... That's just as good of a choice. No, no. No, it's not. Oh, I know. Minecraft let's, Steve is tremendous. Let's put Laura from the big city in Smash. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> like, that's a perfectly logical choice. I know. Let's put Thomas the Tank Engine in Smash. Don't. Don't jinx it. I mean, at the time we're recording this, the Game Awards are going to announce a, uh, a yeah. new character in Smash. Oh, so. I'm, I'm looking forward to it. I am looking forward to seeing the travesty that they put in um, in Smash this time. So, Who do you think it's going to be? I don't, dude. After after seeing Steve, I'm like, they might as well just put a Fortnite character in. You crazy son of a bitch, you did. They might as well. I feel like they will probably put Fortnite in there. Yep. I, that's the one. And if character. they do that, I'm selling my copy of Smash. It'll do gangbusters if they do it. Well, yeah, of course it is. But that's yeah. the point, though, is that all of this is just for it's just for money. It is. It's just just for money. It's not about the content anymore. It's just yeah, we it's, we it's a money grab. Sure, but I mean, I don't. I I like Minecraft. I don't like Fortnite. Yeah, I like Minecraft. I like bad games. It's not a bad game. It's a great game. No, it's not. It's delightful. It's a game where you can go out and just carve your own, like, leave your own mark in the world and just oh. adventure. You know where own. you can do that too, real life. So why don't you go do that right now, actually? <laughs> well, I can do that in real life, but I can't build a fucking castle in real life. <laughs> I can do that in Minecraft, and I can blow it up too without any consequence. Yeah. Huh. Huh. Oh, this thing. Oh, look at that. Little jiggly. Oh, here we go, here we go. Yeah, get him. But in all seriousness, no, I, I think... I, I I guarantee one of them is probably going to be Waluigi. You think... No, I, I... 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 What was I watching the other day? But somebody said that they'll probably... Or no, I think we were just talking... Oh, yeah, I was talking at work. Um, and, uh... Um... Uh, my assistant manager's uh, uh, prediction was that uh, they'll probably save Waluigi for the last one. That's what I was thinking too. Yeah, I don't know. I if was like, oh, that one. would make that would actually make sense, just to kind of appease everybody and stuff. So. At this point, that has to happen. There's been so many people, I, even though it's kind of a joke, and I think even yeah. Sakurai and them have kind of acknowledged that, like, well, they kind of, they just want it because it's just gonna be funny. Yeah. Which I can see why they wouldn't want to put him in because of that, but I feel like at this point, like everybody wants it though. Like it's just it's a joke character. Yeah. Like every fighting but game has to have well, one. Well, if you put Waluigi in there, that makes more sense than Steve from Minecraft. It does though. Don't don't even. At least Steve is interesting. 
what's not interesting about Waluigi? What, He's you, at least a Mario character. Are you gonna give him a tennis racket? Like, what, what, what are you gonna do with Waluigi that's not just gonna be like a template Mario character? Well, maybe they make a Waluigi game now. If they put him in there, maybe he gets his own game. They will never make a Waluigi game. Why not? They made Wario a game? Wario's a good character. Waluigi's like a bootleg <laughs> ripoff. A fucking, like, dumpster. Like, oh, we gotta give him a sibling because Mario has a sibling. Fair. No, Wario I... is a real video game character. Waluigi's just some fucking disaster that Hudson cooked up. <laughs> and he's... somehow he, like, snuck into, like, the Nintendo canon. He's... He's survived the test of time. He sure has. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Oh, man. What's happening? <gasps> I, like, I completely blanked out during that conversation. I forgot where we were at. There's oh. a Magi. It sure is. <laughs> oh. And then he can do this shit. Oh, he that's right. Yeah, he can just summon more of these things. What an asshole. Oh, yeah. This, this... Dang it. I hit the wrong button. My bad. My bad. Gotcha. He's done it. No. No. Oh, you have to do like the, the stab. With the stab there. Oh, I don't have to do anything. He works. He's fucking dead. He's, damn it. Oh, he's got the fisticuffs. There he goes. God damn man. Die. Thank you. a precarious situation. Yeah, I know. It's just like a lot happening. Yeah. That's the problem with this fight, is like all of a sudden a lot of things happen. Oh, good. Gary him. He's a problem. And he can just hang up up there. Yep. Which is the problem. Yeah. Made him dizzy. Get a little butt poke. There you go. There you go. No way. Look at that. There's a bunch of keys. A bunch of keys. Keys. Got a lot of keys for I forgot you. my keys. Hey, hey, uh, hey, I got a joke for you. What's that? Uh, do you know what a, uh, a, a janitor's uh, favorite enemy in the, uh, Zelda is? What's that? It's a pile of keys. <laughs> Get it? Get it? It sounds like keys, but it's, it's not. <laughs> Shut the episode off. You know what? You know what? Delete the channel too while you're at it. Do you know what? Go ahead and delete your Twitter. Okay. Yeah, that's your punishment. All right. All right, I'll, I'll, I'll get on that. I appreciate you sticking to your guns, though, and going through with the bit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, crap. Man, this fight's still going on, huh? Yeah, because I gotta... I gotta find this dude. Where's he at? There oh, he is. There he is. Oh, crap. I need the... I need my bow and arrow. Oh, he's oh, just summoning guys. Never mind. I thought he was gonna hit you when you were looking at the gameplay. Oh, no, he just summons guys so, yeah. to do his bidding. There he is. Whack him. Oh, no, he does throw fireballs. Oh, he does? Oh, okay. All right. And chop that off. And chop you off. Take his belt. He's no longer the champ. Do you um, collect the championship belts and learn new techniques from the swordsman? Yeah. That's right. Mm -hmm. I think it's 20. If I, I feel like we should be close by now. We can pick up quite a few of those. Dang it. Oh, he just spawned right back where you shot him. All right. That works for me. Gotcha. Hey! He's dead. Sorry, bud. Uh, Thanks for playing. The wizard king is dead. The king is dead. Long live the new king. <laughs> and it's just just Link going, Hey, guys. Hey. hey. How's it going? Hi. Hi. Come on. He doesn't actually <laughs> give out commands. He just goes, Hyah! Yeah, right. Or whatever he was doing uh, on the last episode with the <laughs> sound it sounded like Popeye after eating too much spinach. Yeah. Uh, Sounds like he stubbed his toe. <laughs> it does. It does. Uh -huh. All right. What all right. we get? What is this? Is this the? Right. Oh, this is not the big boy key. Nope. It's a hook shot. shot. Look at that. Hey, we got the hook shot. Oh, got the hook shot. It's weird that there's two different grapple items in this game. Mm-hmm. No, it is. It's a little weird, but they they make it work. So they do. All right. Is this the double hook shot, or is that just uh, Twilight? That was that was only in Twilight. Okay. They only ever did the double in Twilight. If I which remember. one? Uh, which one did Skyward Sword have? Was that also a double, or is that just a single? 
Because I, I feel like you can chain up on a single. wall and then just like shoot to like another area on that one too. I thought that was just a one. Maybe. Single. Yeah, you might be right. Maybe it's just Twilight that has the double. Huh. I always liked the double hook shot. I thought that was kind of cool. Yeah. Huh. All right. Well, I think I think that's a good spot to leave it off for this episode. We got that hook shot. We got that hook shot. So probably on the next episode, we're we're gonna be fighting the boss. Yeah. So. All right. We will see you guys next time. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.